everyone. Praise the Lord. Very good morning. I'm happy that God has brought us together to meditate His wonderful word. May God speak to us as we meditate His word. May the uh, grace of God fall upon us as we meditate through the spiritual breakfast session. May He alone be glorified. And today, uh, before we meditate, I want to mention to you that today is celebrated as, uh, we, we cannot say celebrated as, uh, commemorated, commemorated as the World Calamity Awareness Day. Uh, the UN has announced, the United Nations has announced uh, today, the October 14th, as the Day of World Calamity Awareness. So, remember the nations that, that is facing the uh, calamities uh, like tsunamis and uh, so many uh, things. You know what are the things that affect the nations, uh, especially things, uh, nations around that, that Japan and they, they, they uh, see the tsunami again and again. That is very common for them. So, remember all the, all the nations that are going through calamities. May the Lord be gracious on them. Today's meditation is from the book of Acts chapter 6 verse 10. But they could not stand up against the wisdom the Spirit gave him as he spoke. We are seeing about Stephen yesterday. We saw that when God started to use Stephen, there were opposition uh, uh, aroused against him. And uh, uh, yet he did not stop. Look here what the Bible says. They could not stand up against the wisdom that Spirit gave him. They questioned him, but he was answering but they could not stand before the answers he gives because as we meditated earlier uh, if you look about two verses three two or three verses you will know stephen was filled with holy spirit and the power of spirit so when he spoke it was not him he was speaking but it was the holy spirit who spoke to him it was not the wisdom that Stephen had but it was the wisdom of the Holy Spirit so Stephen was not having the it, it, it does not say that uh, Stephen had the knowledge of the world he had studied so much so many things is uh, he is no he knows so many things so uh, he doesn't uh, bother about he he is a well educated man Bible doesn't say all those things but he was full there he was filled with the Holy Spirit and the wisdom of the Spirit was revealed through him. So that made a change in him and the opposite people who were against him could not stand against the wisdom that was revealed through Holy Spirit. My dear brothers and sisters, do not worry, you may not be studying, you, you may not be well educated, but the wisdom of the Holy Spirit will be revealed through you. I'm not, I'm not talking about the uh, people who are talk on actives uh, who, who impact people through the way they speak. I'm not speaking all, I'm not speaking about those people. You were, you were opponent maybe such man or such woman, but remember you have the Holy Spirit in you. When the wisdom of the Holy Spirit is revealed through you, even those people cannot stand before you because Holy Spirit's wisdom is all powerful. It, it is glorious. Through Stephen, the wisdom of the Spirit was revealed. Even through you, when people are coming against you, if you are filled with the Holy Spirit, the wisdom of the Spirit will be revealed to you. And definitely no man in the world can stand against the wisdom of the Holy Spirit. God bless you.